Okay, there we go. That's a little better. Okay, good. What was I talking about? Hey, Poggle, be sure to come and chat with me once you can link quests so I can give you your rewards. I don't think I've updated my infinite beacon bit. Okay, I have Chomchi the Chikorita is on my team. It's level 13. It's holding... What the hell is it holding? I haven't played this in a long time. An Orenberry. Makes perfect sense. What's in my bag? What items do I have? Potion, a star piece, uh, 14 rare candies. We start with some balls. We have literally every HM in the game. Um, I have an infinite number of berries. I've got a bike, a super rod. I don't think I have anything in the PC. Yes, my character's name is Pogo. I think we named him Cringo on the original playthrough. And then when I did it off screen, he was Pogo. What is... How much money do I have? Oh yeah, I've got 30,000. I've not spent any of my money. Let's go do that. Pogo! I have no idea what's happening. Congratulations, Pogo. I can't believe you managed to defeat the champion. Oh, wait. Is this immediately after I got my winning playthrough and then the game didn't save? Okay, wait. That might be good then. So let's pr this is like imagine this is like a direct follow-up to the last time I streamed except now I instead of having a Sudowoodo starter I have a Chikorita and also um, Imagine I won instead of hitting escape and closing the game. Of course. Where are my manners? The name's Abby, but you can call me Pokeby. I'm the dev behind Emerald Rogue. As a reward for being the champion, I would like to welcome you to my lab. I've uncovered the secret entrance inside the config lab, so please feel free to come take a look in any moment. So I actually, before I did this, uh, but after I streamed, I don't know where the config lab is. I, okay, maybe I did spend money, because I remember buying like a bunch of shops and stuff. Is Birch's lab? Here's the config lab. There's actually a secret you can do. Uh... I don't know, I don't remember what you have to do, but you can unlock this doorway before you beat the champion and unlock all the Pokemon. But I beat the champion, so I just did it legit because I'm good at the game. Ah, Pago, welcome to my lab, or what I like to dub the expansion room. Uh-oh, I gotta get out of here. Do not tweet about the expansion room. You can use this room to enable special modes, and although there's not too many now, I'll be sure to add more in the future. Well, this is not updated, by the way, so... Hi there, Pogo. I can adjust the enabled generation if you like to expand or shrink types of Pokemon you'll encounter. If you're using national mode up to Gen 3, would you like to change it? I would like every Pokemon ever made. No, Scarlet and Violet? Now you encounter Pokemon up to Generation 8. That's so based. What is this? Kanto Leader is currently off. Turn that shit on. Johto Leader is currently off. Turn that bitch on. Yeah, Ho Hoenn's good. Hoenn Routes is good. Okay, yeah, we want we want every gym leader in the game available. That's a ditto. A ditto? Why is it here? Dude, he's vibing. We're enjoying Emerald Rogue for enable any special modes. Absolutely. I should update the game somewhat. Would you like to take the Mega Ring? Fuck yes. I would like to take the Mega Ring. Would you like to take the Z Power? I'll take it. I'm not really a big fan of apparently we can get slammed by Z moves though. Child, you startled me. I can offer you some curses to add some extra challenge to your future. Can we get ourselves an Applin? Uh, I mean, objectively, yes. It is Gen 8. We just have to find it. I don't think I want to... Fuck with curses. I think we're good. I don't think we need curses right now. Thank you for the offer, though. Bagwipe. What the hell? If enabled in a bargain adventure, the contents of your bag will be wiped and you will be given the starter items instead. No? Absolutely not? I would. That's a no for me, dog. Enable reward EVs is currently on. When enabled, Pokemon will gain EVs at the very end of trainer battles. These reward EVs will be given based on the nature of the Pokemon gaining them. These features tend to be a reward mechanic for not having Pokemon faint. Uh, I mean, we, we'll take the reward. Allow over leveling. Yeah, no, we don't allow that. EXP all is currently on. Yes, that just prevents grinding. Trainer difficulty is currently average. That, the gyms are the hard part. We don't need trainers in our... 
Item rates is average. I'm okay with... Excuse me, ma'am. Legendary encounter. What is this? Adjust the rate and quality of legendary encounters may appear. Easy, make sure any legendaries may appear fairly frequently. Average result in few legendary encounters and the quality of those legendaries will get stronger the further into a run you are. Hard result in few encounters and stronger legendaries will not appear. Okay, well, we'll leave it as is then. Config lab, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm just making sure I'm happy with everything. Seated mode. I will never touch seated mode. No. 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 There's a great guy who us in the battle tower running around the config lab earlier. He kept screaming now over and over again. It was very confusing. I don't remember anything about the overworld, so I'm checking it real quick. Would you let me explain how adventures work? No, I didn't. Nope, I know that. Yeah, can I take another one? Poor Lapras must be lonely. Oh, these are the Pokemon I turned away. Shouldn't be fucking surprising you that I turned away. I mean, Lapras is good. I just... Oh, I gotta change the stream. I forgot. I also didn't mark the stream. Oopsie poopsie. Uh... We're playing, uh... Playing Pokemon Emerald Road. Okay, that's not an option, so I guess I'll just go Pokemon Emerald version. And make the stream title Pokemon Emerald Road. are you the name raiders house absolutely not took me a while i finally figured out what the route names mean do you want me to tell you no i know this already do i have a speed up button i don't think i do okay what are you close shop i think i'm already dripped out i think that's why i'm wearing black is because i came in here and changed my clothes yeah because i'm wearing that one now We're, we're, we're good. We're vibing. Oh, you this is you have to talk to them instead of going and changing it manually. I need to know what the speed up button is. Do I not have one? Is there an emulator settings option? I didn't mean to hit that. I mean, I get a bike at least. That's pretty good. This game is relaxing. Ah, oh, yeah, man, yeah, this game is really relaxing. It definitely, nothing is gonna go wrong at any point to stress me out during this. Dude, I do kind of want to buy some TMs, actually. Why, yes, I will immediately try to go full uh, toxic mode. Don't mind if I do. That's what he's really good. Rest is tempting. I don't think I need these right now. We're preparing. We're preparing for the hard mode run incoming where every Pokemon is available. I should buy potions, actually. Massively, I should buy potions. Oh my! Listen, we, we need to... We need to... How many of these can I buy? I got two. Give me five. And then give me 
Because we want to we wanna be able to catch Pokemon. So, I, if I remember correctly, the items I buy here in the overworld... Uh... They're gonna, they're gonna be with me for every run. Like, obviously, when I use them in the run, I lose them, but then when I come back to the overworld, I'll have them again. What are you? You're looking much faster now, so here, take the mock bike. Oh, baby. Is that it? Is that all you give me? You exist just for the mock bike? Alright, then. I've already been to these buildings. Yeah, whatever. Reflect and whatnot. But only had surf. You don't even need to teach them your Pokemon to use them anymore. But only had surf. Chomchi used surf. Chomchi's going pog wild. So this one's a competition to try and complete an adventure with the weakest Pokemon possible. You can join on our own small holiday if you'd like. Okay. Is that, is that it? Is that like a secret? I mean, it's obviously it's a challenge, but... Chomchi is so based. I think maybe I'll save a little of my money. For future runs. Because I think I can, like, buy items. What are you going to attack? What the hell is this, actually? Safari Zone? Okay, so this is like catch Pokemon to take into runs permanently with you. That's good to know. We're not going to do that right now. We're going to just run deep, I think. That's fucking useless to me. I don't want that. What a- what- I know it's taking me forever to, like, pick a thing to go into. What's your nature? Special defense up, attack down? That's a pretty good nature, I think. We're gonna ball. We're going. Excuse me? Oh, hey, Pogo. Pokebee has gone and added some extra modes here for you to try. Oh, my? I got a Starf Berry. And a Salad Berry. What are the modes? Hello, mister? What was that? Ah? What if I... Say small holiday to this man. Based on what that random individual told me. Whoa! That there's the secret phrase for the best cup campaign. When you take part in a campaign, settings will be changed to give a unique challenge. I may swap out your Pokemon and change some of the items in your bag. I may also edit your settings in the config lag. Each campaign has specific setup rules and restrictions. You want to give the best cup a... No? Not right now. Base stat total cup. The gist of it is that you want to try and complete a full run using the weakest Pokemon you can find. The Pokemon with the lowest base stat. Every Pokemon you have in your party will be considered for the score. For this campaign, you'll have to enter a standard battle adventure. Gauntlet in a rainbow mode ain't allowed. Finally, this campaign will adjust config settings and TM Toxie is banned. Fuck. There's a score will update when starting a battle to give you a chance to catch your release mods. You'll know if the campaign is active. It'll be announced to you at the start of the adventure, and you'll be able to go to your review tour in the pause menu. Uh, no. We just want a regular run for now. Okay. I, j I truly wish I knew... How to adjust emulator settings. Whoa, whoa, something came up for a second. A key, escape key. God, I wish I knew how to trigger speed up. I 
there like fan-made ones that have a speed up option? Dude, there sure aren't. Wait, community layouts? No. Let me try something. Let me see if there's a- Cause, cause the, the speed up will help a lot when I'm playing the game. I think this is just the regular mode. Would you like to go on an adventure? Yes. Which battle style would you like to use? Singles. Save my game. Yeah, override it. Emerald Rogue Steam Deck Speed Up Button. I found it! Okay, I used Google and found it. Okay, so we want to go... Settings? I may have missed settings already. Settings? Input? Hotkeys? Fast forward, I will make this key. I think that's it. It like legit doesn't work. Hold up. Steam Deck's a little wonky with trying to change emulator settings. Oh, because it's not available. Okay, I think that does it now. That's how you do it. I gotta hit them both at the same time now. That's basically only gonna be used for battles. It's a calm, sharp route. Probably metal types. Calm, I think, is more Pokemon, less trainers. That's fighting types. That's water types. We could always use a water type. Water type's pretty good. That is a Nurse Joy up there, though. I don't think we have to take it though. I think we can go. I think we can get a water type. Okay. Four Pokemon. We wanna we wanna browse the area a little, look for some items. That's not a bad item. Alright. Pokemon time, it's a Surskit. That sucks. I'm gonna keep it real, we ain't, we ain't taking Surskit. Oh my! Okay, we'll take an Aerodactyl though. I, like, I don't want to attack it. It's level 2. Just throw a Pokeball. We might have to Great Ball it. Damn it. I'm gonna... I mean, I, we need Aerodactyl. Okay. That's Pog. Okay, I was not expecting to find an Aerodactyl here. I'm very happy with that, though. Oh my! Alright, yeah, we're running Gen 2 strats now. Can we... Okay, it lived to tackle. That means we should be able to Pokeball it. Fantastic. Yeah, honestly, straight... Oh, I killed it. Yeah, we can learn Roar. We can learn Roar over Scary Face. Okay, very good. No, I mean, we can kill him. We can just kill the things for, like, a slight amount of experience. You will take Bite over Scratch. 
the team is already getting juiced up. Uh, I definitely want to find another Fungus. I think Fungus could be cracked for the team. There it is. You can probably just Pokeball it. Yeah, absolutely. Alright, so immediately, like, the first gym is gonna be a, a cape walk. Now, we can't just use our knowledge at Gen 3 anymore, because I've turned on the Kanto and Johto gym leaders. Ooh, I can mock bike up there, though. Ooh, I can do a few things now. I've got secrets I didn't have before. Some bonuses per- Oh my! Hold up. Hold up. Wait, that's cracked. Okay. We're actually going pog wild now. We're actually discovering secret Pokemon that aren't even listed on the map. I don't need you. I can kill you though for experience on the boys. I think 15 is the, uh, level cap for these lads. Yeah, Mega Drain is better than Absorb. Mud Bomb is better than Mud Spore. Okay. I have accidentally triggered a battle. It's okay, we will obliterate them. Okay. Can I go in there? I don't think so. No. I may have missed a couple items by getting cute with it. Am I missing something? Oh, okay. You can't be doing the... If they're at the same time, you can't just do it. It's not automatic. That's what I was missing. I may have missed a couple items, but that's okay. Runs go very long. That's why we're using the speed up here. We can, we can turn the bike off. Alright. What's the next area? Average typical route. There's going to be a lot of normal types, I think. Us having all of the HMs from that run I won is very based. This is going to give us big stat increases. That's a trainer battle. We, we don't need to fight trainers. We're already like at the level cap. Keep it for secrets. So are you irrelevant? I think I think there's just water types in general that spawn regardless of the area you're in. <sighs> Fuck, that's so bulky and I killed it. I don't need you. I actually want a happy. That's fine. I I'm not lying. I think bulk might be the way to go in this game. I think stalling all the homies out is like definitely a legit play. You're good. In fact, I think you're better than Meganium. As much as I hate to say it. Would that leave us open to ice? Ice would do some damage to us. Ice still does some damage to us. As much as I love Chomchi, I don't think there's a situation where Turtwig isn't better. Like, unironically.
Thank you for your hard work. Um, you're a Meganium enjoyer, if so based. I don't dislike Meganium. I do think it's my least favorite of the three Johto starters. But I think the Johto starters are some of the best, so that doesn't like say too much. God damn, I got paralyzed. I hate my life. Sweet Kiss is Confusion. We can get rid of Copycat. Okay. I want the item that's down here. Aerodactyl getting paralyzed sucks, but that's okay. Well, that is the issue with turning on the hotkeys, is I don't know what button just paused the game, and I so I don't know how to unpause it. Okay, it was that. Everyone knows a good long deck dino. I, I value Meganium a lot more in Infinite Fusion than I do in this, because I think it has good fusion potential. Whereas in this, it's just kind of a grass type that's bulky. And I think in that regard, Torterra is a better member of the team. I did not mean to run into you. In a Rangaroo! You're dead. Also, all your guys are level 5, so... I do think our team is cracked, and we're going to smoke the first gym. Uh, but is gonna get harder as we go. That's kind of why we're speeding through this, because there's not a lot of lot of. Oh my! Oh my! I want the item. I can beat you up and get the item. Because there's, there's not a lot of thinking to be done early. I got I got a full team. They're gonna be high enough level to smoke the first gym. And then we see how things go. It's a Mart rest stop. Okay. Pokeball shop? I don't need them. We're doing good. We only got $950. We gotta, like, be wise here. How many potions do I have? Four? I think we're good. Antidotes? Three? Paralyzed heals? We got six? Yeah, I think I spent money stocking up on these in the hub wall. We can grab a couple of these. Just in case. God, this shit moves so slow when it's not on speed up. Okay, Ice Heal is the only thing I didn't stock up in the overworld off screen. That's nothing. I sure as shit can't afford any of those. Well, I don't need any of them right now. Ice Beam ain't bad. You know what? I should have items I can sell that I kept. Yeah, I kept these. I didn't sell these in the overworld specifically so I could sell them in the main game for impulse money. I think Ice Beam has real potential. It could be good on my team. I think there's a few guys who could benefit from Ice Beam. There's I no value in the name raider. Now the question is, okay, can anyone learn Ice Beam now that I've grabbed it? Totodile and Shellos. Totodile is probably who I'm giving it to. It's a mighty trick. Okay. We're already maxed up. So here's where we gotta fight a gym leader. You gotta fight through eight of these, then get to the Fatal Four or whatever the hell. give surf to some of y'all? I mean, like, immediately we're gonna give surf to the two water types. We, we kind of got some cracked, some cracked starting movesets here because I have HMs and my, my buffs from whatever. Uh, I literally don't think I need to give any of this to anyone else. Yeah, we get rid of Water Gun for Surf. Like, these two having Surf is actually already insane. 
We have to be a little more careful with Earthquake. We do only get one of those. Aer Aerodactyl getting it is based. If Torterra can learn it in the future, that might be worth more. I'm going to get save Toxic for now. Because we're not using Hephaenian Battle. I think Fungus is going to get Toxic on its own. We're going to save the Protect as well. I think we can probably go ahead and give the Ice Beam to Totodile. Well, you're more... Wait, wait, wait. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Because you're going to be more of a physical attacker, aren't you? Yes. Because is it, is it red is what gets increased? Yeah, red is the increase. Blue is the decrease. So, Totodile, we actually shouldn't give Ice Beam. Because he's going to be more of a physical attacker. I do have a couple other things in here. Raises the base attack stat. I think immediately we want to go all in on the defense of these two. Yeah. Base special defense. Like I said, we're, we we go all in on you. Base attack is a little trickier. I think probably Aerodactyl. We could go sweeper mode with him. Totodile is another backup pick there. Base HP, that's 100% HP. Okay. I don't know who the gym leader is, so I don't know who we lead with. I think we can just lead with Totodile. He's got Surf. He's going to be doing some good damage no matter what. We've led correctly. A new challenger? Don't hold back now. I've just remembered Dunks is outside. I gotta bring him in. I'm not gonna lie to you all. I'm honestly, I'm getting a little sick to my stomach. It came out of nowhere. I think we'll, we'll probably end it after this gym battle, the stream. And we'll come back to this sooner rather than later. And at least finish this run, and I'll edit them together for YouTube. Because I was fully prepared to do more, but my, my belly's feeling not so good right now. So we're going to just sweep Flannery real fast. First gym leader, not much of a threat. Numel, I hit Sir. Magnitude 7's a little scary, we might lose Totodile here, I forgot to give anyone items. Okay, we're good. We are gonna get Totodile out of there, though. Um... I think we can just go into Aerodactyl. And be fine. Yeah. And then we get fully healed after a gym battle. And then I'm gonna rest. This is a, essentially the quick save. I gotta use the restroom and bring Dunks in. Uh, we'll continue this another time. It was a good stream. There will be more. Thanks for coming. I'll see you all next time. Sorry for the abrupt end. So crunchiness fixed. Volume decent level we can finally start uh, this is gonna be edited in the end of the where we ended the playthrough before when I had to shit myself if I had a fossil starter who would it be it would be uh, Arkin 100% I love me the claw motherfucker it's a tough chili route who is my team again Totodile Turtwig Aerodactyl, Fungus, Shellus, Hapini. This is kind of a base team. Average Warm Route. Marcus, or Market Battle Shop. This is just a market. Magical? I assume is Psychic. That's Bug. I think we just do these two and go to a market.
get some items. Dude, three sweet apples? Oh shit, dude. I'm, it remind me to never come to a chili route ever again. Oh, maybe I don't have, I have to do ice puzzles. I thought it was gonna make me do a shitload of ice puzzles. Chili route kind of sucks. I hate being in a cave. Oh my! Do we need an electric type? We're probably okay. I like already forgot they had like up to Gen 7 Pokemon in this. There's only one other thing here. Why did Turwig use Rock Smash? Bro, this sucks. Oh, it's a Lola and Volpix, okay. Ice Electric is crazy, I just like our team. Famous last words. We're speed, we're speed running. Okay, Intimidate, I hit you with Surf. Holy crap. I assume it just used quick attack. We lost Totodile. It's time to pick up an electric ice. <laughs> uh, Curse is a pretty good move, actually. It's be it's objectively better than Withdrawal. Goodbye, Totodile. I don't need agility. Ingrain could be good. Ingrain's better than Bide. I'm never using Bide. Can I name Arctazolt? Yeah, sure, why not? Do I know Ooh, Rock Hidden Power. That's a little that's a little secret mouse tool for flying types. We don't need mud slap. We got a grottle. That's it. All right. Well, let's let's do the smart thing and have not our grass type out front. Uh, do you have moves that do damage, Hippini? You've pound. Okay. I'm, I'm noticing we're actually very weak to ice. At least it's like a decently strong one. Like a level 11 is not bad. Oh wow, that did nothing. Holy shit. Can I just get you with an Ultra Ball? Can I just pop you real quick? Okay, incredible. What are you naming it? Or is its name Coolio? assume it's Coolio unless I, I see otherwise. Their name is Coolio. Okay. Alright, new ice type just dropped. Let's battle. Alright. Dragon type Drampa. Let's hit the sweet kiss. Uh alright, we're gonna immediately pivot out. Uh you just hit me with a damn fire blast. Do fucking shitloads of damage. Please eat this. Okay. We're gonna be fine. Uh your normal dragon? I like don't have anything to do against. This is an insane Pokemon for you to just have. You can take a fire blast. I like fear Drampa because I expect it to have water moves. 
Okay, this should mean it can only use Fire Blast one more time. Which means then we can go into our Ice type. Oh, we could also just kill it. Oh, actually, it's already out, so. Thank you, Aerodactyl. Fungus wants to learn Faint Attack? I think it's better than Astonish. Ooh, Coolio learned Echo Voice and Ancient Power. Uh, I never use Charge. Maybe I should, but I just don't. Please, free me. Damn it, there's a level 14 one. Alright, we need, we need someone better up front. I guess just straight up Coolio up front. We're brute forcing this puzzle. I don't feel like trying to solve it. He's so good. No, I missed an item. Oh, well. I just think Coolio's a fitting name for Argazol. Yes, sir. Ooh, three shiny stones and three metal coats. That's kind of base. We don't need them right now, but we could end up needing them. Purple Nectars? Isn't that just for Oracorio? Fitting yet silly. Alright, Heavy Balls are pretty good. Okay. It's, well, listen, we, that's just something to sell. We don't, need, we don't need that many metal coats. Uh, you know what? Let's try it. Let's try and get the item. Is it doable? I'm not confident. Oh, you have to start from where that rock is to get it. Okay, I understand. I will simply not be getting it then. I already muffed this. How did I do this? It was like this. I need to get out of here. I'm sick of fucking finding two Pokemon over and over. They've accidentally gone to this item. Alright, that's pretty big. Good evolution items, which is good money. Oops, didn't mean to fight you. I don't know why, but you're one of the few people I actively enjoy watching the Pokemon kinds of stuff. I appreciate that. Holy crap, you have a bird type? You absolute buffoon. Look at this idiot bringing a bird type to the cave. Rain dance. Holy! Yeah, give her a water pulse for sure. We should build a rain setup team because I definitely have the brain power to make that work. That's useful. Oops. Um, I don't think I'm gonna get to that item. I could try, but I could also just focus on getting out of here. He's done it. Ooh, I know how to get the item. He's cracked. It was not worth it. Put me back in. Don't make me stay here. No. No.
You shit me right now? Get this out of here. I don't care about that. Okay, I think it was here. Up. Dude, it sure wasn't. Fuck! I think I just did this, but I already forgot where I'm supposed to go. Was it? God damn it! I'm never taking a chili. I'm never taking anything that might be a cave ever again. I can't take two fucking steps! We made it. Get me out of here! Ah! You think Coolio might have a part to play in your possible rain setup? Uh, dude, if he can learn thunder, thunder is 100% accurate in rain. No! Okay. I got so scared because it said chili. I'm glad we're going to a market after this. Fuck, you're good? I don't need another ice type. Even though, like, Obama Snow is, like, really good. By the way, I'm not, like, don't worry. I'm not gonna, like, start sacrificing members just to build rain team. I would have to be, like, very confident that we were gonna have a whole rain team. And even then, I'm not confident that, like, I would be good enough to run the rain team properly. I'm not, like, a good Pokemon player. As you can tell by me letting Totile get killed by like a quick attack or whatever. Am I out here? Nope. Okay. Dun dun dun. Oh, we could surf over there. We should surf over there. It's a free item. He can? Oh, Pog? Another man for the mission? Three Moo Moo Milks! We're so in it. I wanted to fight this guy, because I think this will get us to our level cap of 25. I thought that cast form was shiny for a second. Dude, let's use Echo Voice. Let's use Echo Voice and kill him. So good. Uh, yeah, you should definitely learn Ancient Power. I like your moveset, though. That's base 90 Echo Power, though. Okay, I want to keep Supersonic as like a last resort kind of move, so we'll take Ancient Power. I don't think Hypeenie evolves by Friendship, by the way. I think I need a Hard Stone. So maybe I should have gone to a battle uh, market in hopes of finding one. Bro, the exit? I don't know why sometimes it flashes like that. Dun, 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 dun. Oh my! I genuinely don't know how I just threw an Ultra Ball right there. I was trying to stop the speed up. And I just auto-caught him. Okay. Uh, I actually think we have to get rid of Blissey. Or Happiny. Yeah. Because, like, I have no idea when we're gonna get the stone to evolve it. The oval stone or whatever. What an insane Pokemon to just have here. Gamer cheating evidence finally found. Aw, oh, man! Listen, we can't justify taking it, even though he is Pog. I want to just try and learn Autonomize. Sheds additional weight to sharply boost speed. The sweep, you say? Swords Dance Autonomize. I don't think I need Pursuit. Okay, we no longer need a totemize. 
Aerial Ace? It can't miss. I think it's better than Fury Cutter. Okay. Team's looking juiced. Then we have a rest stop. The Rando Man. Is there anyone we don't like? I don't think so. I actually think our team's kind of cracked. The worst member might be Fungus or Coolio, but they each, like, serve a purpose. Okay, first things first, we're selling. We're, we're like, good on Pokeballs. Forging Rare Candies is insane because I had those left over. Heal Powder's good. That's good. I don't need these. That's a free three hundred dollars. Um. In no world will we need more than one sweet apple. This is literally free money. We can sell one Dawnstone and one shiny stone. Team is legit getting cracked. That's why it'll change when the, most of them die in the next boss fight. I actually don't think this team is cracked at all. This team has good potential, but I need more, like, stat setup. The Hone Edge is an insane grab. Especially with it already... I didn't mean to back out everything. Especially with it already having Swords Dance Shadow Sneak. Raise base special defense. I did waste some of my stat boost pumping them in the happy but whatever. Who do we want to raise the special defense of? Probably Fungus? Fungus should probably be bulky. And y'all ready to learn Earthquake yet? Holy! I don't think we need Supersonic. More than we need Earthquake. Yeah, we hold, we're holding on the Toxic Protect until we get our guys to, like, their, their final form. I'm content with everyone where they are. Who are you? What do you sell? The general shop. If two, give me four more. I could buy repels in case we get an ice cave again, but that's weak shit. I'd rather just never get an ice cave again. What are you selling? Ice beam! Double team! Okay. Okay. I want this. I want flamethrower. In case we decide to go rain mode, give me another rain dance for the future. I don't know if what's his name learns ice beam naturally, but we're gonna give it to him either way. Name reader? No, I'm good. And I don't think I want to re-roll any of my guys. I didn't realize I had two ice beams. That was a mistake to buy one. Ooh, you can learn it. We're going to go ahead and just give it to him, because it's just good to have an ice move early. Even if you would learn it naturally, especially because I have two of them now. Um, yeah, we just get rid of Powder Snow, because we just get it. It's a way better move. He does not learn it naturally? All right, that's pretty good to have, then, for sure. Um, we're pocketing double team and rain dance for now. Those are just two moves I want to have. Aerodactyl going and flamethrower? That's kind of crap, but he doesn't need it. So we'll, we'll hold on to that move, too. Okay. It's a mighty trainer. We do not know who the trainer is going to be. And we will not know. Because I should have bought some regular potions for some pre fight heals. I didn't think this through.
I listen, I think it's early enough. I might be able to just go for Hone Edge Sweep, to be honest with you. Attack 44. I can never remember. Is blue the stat that gets increased or decreased? Shellis, what's your nature? Because that'll answer this for me. Quiet nature. Pokemon Quiet Nature. Raises special attack, decreases speed. Okay, so red is your stat that gets increased. Meaning we need to change you real bad, because your attack being lowered sucks. What is Coolio's nature? Neutral. So we definitely need to buy some mints at some point. Let's fish for a Hone Edge Sweep. I don't think we're getting one against Brock. A new challenger. Don't hold back now. That being said, Brock should hopefully not be too hard. Pun not intended. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna try it. We're gonna see what happens. What does he use? Bite? I gotta get out of here. Never mind. I'm bulky. I think we're going in. We don't want to take a third. Plus four shadow sneak. Let's get it. It wasn't enough. How much is that doing? Nothing. That did so little. I'm hitting a third sword stance. That did so little. We're potioning to get the sweep ready. Because this shouldn't do more than like 10. It did 8. That's so good. Okay. Now we, I think we win. Not necessarily. He's a, he's a rock type leader. He's going to have some bulky lads. They may not all go down to a plus 6 shadow sneak. But we can simply hope they do. It did not. Shit, we gotta get out of here. Oh, base! Speed fell. Kill him. Take one more guy out before I swap you out of there. Okay. Alright, Aerodactyl. What's my swap into Aerodactyl? Fuck. If he uses like a ground move, I'm in trouble. Shit, this actually does a lot to me. I'm gonna go into Aerodactyl to see what he goes for. Oh yeah, mine has pressure and his doesn't. Okay. Um. Ancient power, maybe? Yeah, that was pretty good. He going for flinch hacks? He sure is going for flinch hacks. Okay, we got him. We'll have to send someone else out for the final Pokemon, but I think our team should be good. Aerodactyl, I think, is the most threatening thing he can have right now. For my team, anyway. Onyx. I mean, that's just expected. I can probably just go into Grottle free here. Yeah. 
I guess if he hits all five, this can do 25 damage, and that would suck, but he's he doesn't, so we're good. We're just gonna hit Razor Leaf. Yeah, that's nothing. Alright. Brock beaten. Hone Edge put in a lot of work, but it got pretty scary there at times. His weak armor has popped. His defense is down. His speed is up, I think. I think he already outsped me, so that meant nothing. At least he didn't, like, shoot his attack up or anything. See, early, early game Rogue Emerald, the first, like, two gems for sure, maybe three. You kind of just coast off having type advantage. And then as your guys hit, like, their final evolutions, I think after the third gym, you can start having actual, like, setups for them. We're lucky in that Honez just already has his setup. He just needs to get better stats now. So we need to we need to find a battle merchant. So like any of these guys down here. Um Playing a game show is really funny. I do I I feel like I will always take the game show just to make things more interesting. I just play Fall Guys. Well I'll always I'll always take the, the game show as long as it's not like guaranteed to ruin me. Like, obviously, game show is a gamble, and you really shouldn't take it, because it sucks. But, um, there's a battle merchant as well, so... I might as well, like, do the gamble for content purposes. Great Pokemon? Our team is fine. I can't think of any, like, glaring weaknesses our team has. Like, Aerodactyl's a little threatening, don't get me wrong. Once I only put it this way, I can't think of any glaring weaknesses once our guys like evolve. Like once Shellos becomes water ground, we're looking a lot better. I do need like a couple trainers or something to show up so I can get some experience on my guys. No, I don't. I can fight the chancy person. Okay, Alolan Rattata. I didn't even pay attention. To what this route was. A Rangaroo? This is just a fucking animal route. Here in the damn trenches. Not that. I need that. There it is. Alright, pretty good, but we have one. Alright. Lax mint. We got some mints. We do need those. Well, I don't know if we need mints specific. I, I don't know if we need lax specifically. We just need mints in general. Three guard specs. Sorry, what I'm looking for right now. Can we just speed run? We're, we're, we're speeding the map up. Giraffe rig. Pretty pog. I could be killing the wild Pokemon for experience, but like I said, there's like the chance to fight. So we don't need like chancy. If you don't, I hope you don't mind me just, like, speeding up through, like, the regular, like, routes and stuff. Because it's kind of like... The gym battles are what you're here for. The rest of this is just, like, me drafting my stuff and getting it together for the gym battles. Alright, there really wasn't much in that area. We are going to play the game show and then go to the battle merchant. It's a game show? Whoa! Well, hey. Welcome to my ever-so-lovingly set-up game show. This game is simple. You'll get two choices. One may be good, one may be bad. Now on round one. We always pick left here. We always pick left. The left it is. Well chosen. Grottle just got a bit stronger. Pog! On to round two. Pick the left? Yes. Oh! Well chosen! Coolio just got a bit stronger! Oh! He's hitting the dice roll! Oh my god, he's cracked! You will receive a special item! We got three max potions! He's still going! He's going for the quad jackpot! Uh-oh. Okay, that's fine. Dude, uh, basically, I consider that paying $1,000 to get three max potions and... Uh, two of my guys got stronger is kind of an insane deal. Okay. I 
think we know how everyone on my team evolves. Prima guys. <laughs> What are y'all selling? What does the green haired lady sell? I don't think I've seen her before. Ooh, ability caps, okay. Ups attack, but reduces defense. Ups special attack, but okay. I mean, you just have all the mints here, huh? No, oh, you have a lot. Sunstone, chip polish, treasure, dubious disc, oval stone. Damn it, that would've been there for that peony. It's okay. Okay, what's, what's the one we currently have? This is what we have to, we gotta focus on nature first. The mint we currently have. Ups defense, but reduces special defense. I feel like you three are our bulky lads. See, I think we would want to lower your, your speed is actually what we want lowered to raise one of your defenses. I almost feel the same for you. I almost think going defense up, speed down for you would be good. Again, we want your speed lowered. Like, we're running a very slow team. Straight up same. Like, we're, we're just kind of want just everyone slow. We're just gonna run like a really strong, slow team, except for Aerodactyl and Honage. Honage doesn't need speed though. Cause Honage will set up fucking uh, Shadow Sneaks and shit. Slow and strong? I think that's what we're going for here. And then have one fast guy in Aerodactyl. That might not be the ideal way to run it, but. Okay. You have anything that lowers speed? Sure, fucking dumb. Ups attack but reduces defense. That might be what we want for Aerodactyl. Yeah, probably. Yeah, up attack. Minus defense. Yeah, we can buy one of these for Aerodactyl. I think everyone else, we just wait to get some, some speed lowering mints to make them better. I don't know if that's ideal, by the way. I just assume, my, my philosophy has usually been, if a stat sucks, you just abandon it. <laughs> when it comes to the nature. Okay, hold on. Raises the power of water time moves. That's kind of cracked. Is the stream still good? I'm just making sure we're still live because my my laptop lost internet for a second. Shell bells kind of cracked. Raises speed if user misses due to accuracy. I think we can easily buy a shell bell. Yeah, it is. All right, cool. Honestly, I think we can take two shell bells. I think shell bells are really good items. I gotta remember to give people berries. The traveling battle shop, I stock rare held items. Oh my! Okay. We don't have any of these guys, unfortunately. I, got, I, I gotta remember megas are like a thing. Move to leader, I don't need that. Egg move tutor. I need to. I need to see what egg moves my guys have. Okay, destiny bond is not something I would like to use, but it's very doable. Roost. That's kind of big.
I think you can get rid of Ancient Power. Even though that's what helped you against the Aerodactyl before. I think we'll okay. I don't think flying's too big of a threat. I need Roar, because if they start setting up stats on me, I need to use Roar to like get rid of get them out of there. You know what? No, we're not taking Roost. We're not taking Roost. I think Aerodactyl needs to be our one non-bulky guy. He needs to just hit hard and kill. We shouldn't be leaving him in trying to eat hits. I'm gonna do this right now. Fuck, these are great. I don't even know. Wait, clear smog. Eliminates all stat changes. Fuck range strats. I think. Maybe fuck Mud Bomb. We can get a better move than Mud Bomb eventually. 85 accuracy kind of sucks. Being able to wipe their stat changes could be huge. Thrash stockpile. Earth power? That's kind of cracked. Level move to your moves if you'd like. No, I don't need to. Everyone we have right now has kind of like learned their moves already. And what the hell are you? I'm the special move teacher. Okay. What moves you got? Substitute's insane. <laughs> I don't think we need it though. Sky attacks crazy. Setting up curses with Gastrodon in the future could be good, but right now it doesn't feel necessary. Swords Dance on a Torterra is insane. I do kind of want to give you Thunder Wave. Honestly, yeah, replace Echo Voice with Thunder Wave. Okay. We're a little low on money. Um, what Z moves were you selling? Grass and Rock. Torterra with a Grass Z move could go wild. Because you would have the rock Z move, but I can only have Shell Bell. Fungus could have the grass Z move also. Your attack is 60. Your attacks are all dog shit. Okay. Okay. I think we... We sell... Probably some berries. We sell up to 5,000 monies. I'm actually going to sell these. For sure. We can sell one lax mint. I'm unlikely to need them. And 
upping critical hit rate feels unnecessary. We're trying to get to exactly 5k. There's a reason for this. There's a reason for this. This is a crazy berry, actually. I feel like these are broken. I feel like every time I've ever tried to use these, they didn't work. So we'll sell three of them. Okay. We're gonna buy the Grass Zemu, and the reason for this is if we have to send out Fungus for some reason, he can at least hit- he can go Pog crazy with a Grass Zemu. And like, hopefully obliterate the opponent when they think normally Fungus would just die, because Fungus is not good right now. And we're gonna give the Shell Bell to Hone Edge and Aerodactyl as our sweepers. So that they can recover a little health while they're trying to take opponents out. He's our wild card. Uh, it's more like the Z-Crystal is like a last resort for now. Because it's gonna be a bit before he becomes a Moongus. Like, I think we'll have to beat this gym leader and then he can become a Moongus. But he's like, he's like useless until he's a Moongus. I do want to give all three of you berries before the gym fight. Um. Don't I have a Wiccan's Fire? Yeah, give that to Grottle so he can live if he gets hit. Do I have Wiccan's a ground move? We already had the Rock Gym, so we're probably not... Oh, we already had Fire Gym, too, but whatever. Um... We can probably just put regular berries. On the other two. A mighty trainer. All right, we do have to um, beat up the chances real quick. We will use Grottle to do so. Mega Drain. I think we keep Razor Leaf. That's pretty good. And I think is better than Bite for now. Crunch hits for 80. That's 90, that's 100, that's 90. We don't need Crunch. I forgot I made that an emo. Fungus learning Giga Drain is better than Mega Drain. Fungus learning Toxic on his own. We don't need Growth. Amoongus, Amoongus is going to be more of a staller. That's crazy, and is better than Ingrain. You don't need Bison. Hone Edge trying to learn Retaliate. You don't need it. Slash. I don't need to lower special defense. You're not using special moves. We can get rid of that for Slash. Uh, we can now immediately get rid of Slash for Iron Defense. Night Slash. Over here, release. Nah, I like Air Lace. I think Air Lace covers a bit more ground. Coolio's trying to learn Pluck. Eats a berry if they have. That's base 60, that's base 60. We'll keep Thundershock for now. Avalanche, however, is worse than Ice Beam. Okay, we got Torterra. Torterra's trying to learn Earthquake, I think better. Okay, we wasted a little money buying Earth Power, but that's okay. We got Gastronon. We got Dewblade. All right. 
Team's looking good. Team's looking real good right now. I think we lead with Dewblade. Having uh, Iron Defense is pretty good if they're a physical attacker. Fuck, is this the water guy? And this is the fighting type! Oh my god, we have a real chance. Wait, is he fighting? Yeah, yeah, he is, he is. He's fighting, because Crasher wakes the water one. This is so good for me. Who's he leading with? Breloom? Oh, this is so good for me. We're going to open with Iron Defense. This should do nothing. I didn't even not hit fucking five of them, though. Holy shit. Now we're gonna Swords Dance. Because this should do way less to us now. Okay, well he got a fucking crit, because he's a piece of shit. It's still doing five per hit, which is a little bonkers. Is this a skill link? Okay, it's not. He's actually just the luckiest bitch in history. I think we have the super potion here. Fresh water for 30 is probably enough for this skill. He's gonna keep going bullet seed. He is. I need him to not get like four or five per hit. Because if I get another iron defense up, he's not gonna be able to do anything to me. But he's getting like 20 to 25 per turn right now, and that's fucking stupid. Get the second iron defense up. Because he's got the great. This guy already has the greatest RNG of all time, and it's his first Pokemon. We have to prepare for him to be swinging with everything he's got here in a minute. With two iron defenses up, I don't fear the bullet seed. Unless he gets a crit. Oh, are you kidding me? I can't believe this. Crits and it hit five times. All right, it's over for him. Your entire team is dusted. The Pokemon special. We're speed. We're speeding it. Send them out. They're dead. Send them out. They're dead. Send them out. They're dead. Oh, you used protect. That's super funny. He's dead. See you in hell, dumbass. Alright. This is a PC. But this is a big Pokemon! I don't know what the PC is. We, we must replace our fallen comrade with a strong boy. Who are we leading with? I guess Torterra to see what this could be. Are we gonna like fight a guy first? Okay. If we're fighting a guy first, I think Aerodactyl should go up. I think we lost the shell bell that was on Hill Ridge too. I can't remember. Easy, easy, easy earthquake. Ponyard, easy earthquake. Monferno, easy earthquake. Easy earthquake. Aerodactyl's kind of the fucking crap. Did he say anything? Okay, he just says go over here to the battle. Oh, uh, you've made a great point, by the way, that Coolio has Thunder Wave, so we will be leading with him. Here we go. Sounds like a bird, maybe? Hartana? It's shiny? I don't know what type Kartana is. 
I need to like look this up. Kartana is a grass steel type ultra beast. It's not very good typing, I won't lie to you. Okay. Now that being said, with you being a steel type, I think we need to swap out. And probably go to Torterra. He's styling. Incredible. Uh, let's fish. By the way, I think if this is the if this is the same as the regular games, this guy might be almost impossible to catch without a beast ball. Okay, you have aerial ace. That sucks. We're gonna set up leech seed. It doesn't affect, right, because you're a grass type. You're going Aerial Ace. Sin and Gastrodon. Okay, he can heal. So two of his moves do no damage to me. I think I can hit you with Hidden Power Rock to do a little damage. And the Night Slash is your last move. Okay, you have no steel moves. Arc Dissolt is safe to come in. Oh, there's the Orange Berry getting popped. The problem here is it having synthesis and me not having a way to efficiently whittle it down. Okay, we have to swap. Um, Pterodactyl probably. I don't think I can hit any of these without risking killing him. What does a heavy ball do? That did a lot. Um, ooh, that sucks. Uh... power would do a little bit, but not too much damage to him. Yeah. Okay. Let's try one more. Okay. Okay. We're getting crazy paralysis on here. I don't know if we're going to be able to catch this. I'm going to be honest with you. Because Ultra Beasts have like a stupid low catch rate when they're not in Beast Balls. Let's try a Timer Ball. We just gotta start like lobbing balls at him. And hoping for like good RNG. to turn using a potion. See what he does. Okay, he used synthesis. I don't think Ice Beam kills. 
could be wrong, but... Wow, that obliterated him. Wow, he fucking sucked. What a terrible Pokemon, actually. Ooh! Ooh! Okay, hold on. Yes. This is worse than Surf? Oh, it's way worse. Dude, the stall strats. Okay, so we couldn't get Cartana, Cartana, and we lost all of our items. So that's pretty based. Um, let's go here and get a new Pokemon. We have two options here. Yeah, Ultra Beasts have insanely, like, non-existent catch rates. Murkrow? No. No? Okay. Our team's taking, like, a fucking beat, by the way. Dog, that's literally the mint I just had to fucking buy. Ooh, okay, I'll take it. while obtain. Steel Fairy is very good typing. Let me out. Another good potential setup. Ooh, okay, hold up, hold up. Bold Mint, Bold Mint. New Mint just dropped. Ups defense, but reduces attack. We need speed reduced. No, you know what? You're literally not doing physical attacks. God, that was a sad temptation. Dude, what sucks too is I was only doing it because it was like an ultra beast and we needed some shit. That motherfucker is not a good Pokemon at all. Are any of you not doing physical attacks? Like, at all? You might get- I might give you Earthquake and say- Oh no, we should keep- well, it's tough. Yeah, cause you have Earthquake, so we wanna leave you with some attack. And it was shiny. I already forgot it was shiny, to be honest with you. You're using all special, I think? But that's probably not good. Yeah, your attack is way really better. We should pivot you at some point if we get the chance. But who knows if we will. Can I fucking get away from these fights, please? This run is in big danger, by the way. Like, it's not looking good. Let's go down. Focus punch. We'll never use it. Quick balls. Cracked pots basically stuff to sell as far as I'm concerned. Dream balls. How fitting, the dream is dead. Careful, mints. Okay, okay. Up special defense, but reduces special attack. Yes. 
Okay, we might have to use the Nurse Joy here, by the way. Because I think we're fucked. Yeah, our team is really crippled, and I don't have the potions for this right now. So we're going to use the one free heal. Coolio trying to learn freeze dry is crazy good. No, it isn't. We already have moves that are super effective on water types. I guess if it's water ground, it would go crazy. We'll replace ancient power. I think that would be okay. You don't need crunch. Holy shit! Iron defense baton pass! I didn't even realize. Wait, holy shit. Okay, no. We don't need stockpile. You can learn Iron Head. Um. Over punch. Okay, peep this. Keep this strat. Where are my, where are my berries at? Any more citrus or orange berries? I sure don't. We have so many like the guys that are weak to fire. <laughs> Just give them all the fire thing. You're ready to peep the horror. Who is who are we facing? Watson. Oh my. This this could actually go fucking pong crazy. Okay, he's leading with Magnezone. Great back sprite. Electric current. My Mawile has intimidate too. Okay. Set up the iron heads. Okay, it set up a substitute. That's not good. I'm actually a little afraid of what it's going to try and do here. I think I need to break the substitute, like, immediately. Why is it raining and... Okay. Alright. We have the baton pass immediately. So I was going to go into Aerodactyl with Iron Defense. My... Holy shit. Okay, the plus side is here is I am running two ground types. Don't have levitate? He does not have levitate. Big news, he does not have levitate. What's he going for here? Body press. What's that going to do? Not much. We have to kill this Magnezone. We actually outspeed it, which is a little crazy. Okay, Magnezone's dead. It probably had Sturdy. Mawile's gone. A true shame. I was gonna Iron Defense and then Baton Pass Aerodactyl, so it'd be a bulky and also strong Aerodactyl. Electric Dragon, I think we'll be fine. Hit the Leech Seed. We're not fine. Oh, because it's Life Orb? Put a curse on you. We live.
Time for a Zolt fight? Dude, absolutely not. Actually, I guess I would win this one, because it's my ice versus his dragon. There's a better play. Which is to go into Gastrodon, who's immune to the electric attacks outright. And Aerial Ace probably won't do much. Read my fucking inputs. Get dodged, idiot! Please live so I can get a little more health from the leech seed. Pog! Okay, you have flamethrower. I gave you earthquake. I guess I did. Oh, thank God for the berry. I don't even know if this will be enough to save me. Oh, the berry's actually crap. Okay, the berry has saved me. That's why we have it. Lava did nothing. Uh, sucks we never had to make that rain team. I'm gonna go Grass Knot. We're gonna send out a Moongus. Thankfully, our team is, like, really good against Electric. So we have a lot of counters for it. You might- I'm fully prepared for you to have Flamethrower, by the way. Um. We do need to just hit you with a Toxic. Hyper Voice. I don't know what that's gonna do. Not enough. Toxic will at least outpace the dry skin. Boom. Uh, I think we can stall it out. Oh, it's you turning out. You're gonna have flamethrower, 100%. And unfortunately. I don't know what we send in against that. I think we toxic and see what you do. Yeah. But it's raining, so this will do less damage. Yeah, okay. What was I at? I was at 102. A flamethrower did 42 damage to me. I think we live another flamethrower and we heal with synthesis. I think we outpace it with synthesis. Okay, that's an even better move to use. I'll take even less damage from that. He's gone to Rotom. I think the Toxic Strat is gonna just whittle his whole team down. I won't lie, I gained less from the synthesis than I was expecting. Oh, probably because of the rain. That's, that was not a bad play at all. I think I still live a flamethrower here. I think he's just Volt Switch spamming. Reset lower. I don't know what that means. Ooh, that Shadow Ball hit for a lot, and I got he got the special defense drop. Okay, I have to swap. Um
Then we just go Coolio. Pretty good. Uh, Aerodactyl, you Shadow Ball. Do a chunk of damage to him. We can't go for Earthquake. Because I don't know if this thing has a Levitate or not. I think Ancient Power just kills it. <gasps> the Omni Boost! I think Aerodactyl needs to run Buck Wild for us here. This is the thing that scares me the most. It probably has Levitate. We have to just kill with Ancient Power and hope for the best. Oh, that did nothing. We have to live whatever it uses right here. We might. We barely do. Earthquake kills this. Earthquake kills you. I'm so confident. I have a plus one attack and plus one speed. Easy. This is all he has left. We know we don't kill- I know it has Levitate. I know for a fact it has Levitate. Flamethrower does nothing to me. An electric move would literally not do damage to me. Yep. I straight up think I just heal and we win. Uh, I die. We lost Gastrodon. It had fucking Giga Drain. What was that about my team looking real cracked? That being said, um, Amoongus does, like, win this one. Oh, wait. That sucked, actually. <laughs> that Z-move sucks, actually. Fun fact, that Z-move's bad. Oh! Awesome! Okay. Uh, bulky team is over. The entire bulky team is gone. You, you literally don't kill. These moves are used for attacks. That's why it sucked. What the fuck do you think synthesis is? An ability? I don't know what I use here. 
Flamethrower might just kill me. The bulk didn't save. What an insane thing for you to have. No damaging attacks. If it was not meant to be used with effects that have that don't do damage, why the fuck did it have a special effect specifically for using it? The problem is the effect it used had literally nothing to do with the move I used it with. I was expecting it to give me a super heal, not a your stat decreases are gone. Dude, we got a, we, a, an achievement for that? Yeah, the achievement's everybody fucking died. I didn't mean to go this way, but I guess we're gonna be getting all of our teammates from this next area. What items do the rest of you even have anymore? A berry, a berry, a shell bell. Well, Coolio, you're, you're leading the charge here, because... The worst fucking route you could give me. And there's only two fucking Pokemon. Is this a joke? Is this a fuck? You doing a fucking bit right now? Does he move suck as soon as they created? They actually were game ruining, especially because they replaced Megas. Yeah, whatever. No, you're not gonna. You're not. You're, you're, you're gonna make me fucking work for it. You're a fucking cryogonal. Get in the fucking Pokeball. Megas were still around in Sun and Moon? No, they literally weren't. You did make me think for a second. No, no, they were not. Brother, get in the ball. I should have done that. That's that's actually on me. Get in the fucking ball, asshole. Is it a bit? Are you fuck? Are you doing bits right now? Get in the fucking ball, asshole. You think you're an ultra beast or something? Is that is this a joke? Did, did someone forget to tell you what Pokemon you are? Because I think most people forgot that you were a Pokemon. Get in the Pokeball. That's what I thought. Thank God we got more Pokeballs. Dude, I don't... I, like, actually just don't... Believe you. Like you posted that like it's from a wiki. Oh wait, this is actually a little cracked. Where's my max potion? Hyper potion is just as good. It's actually not just as good. It is from the game's wiki. I just don't believe you. I'm sorry to tell you, I just simply don't believe you, and nothing you can say will change my mind. Sorry, Delmi's, uh, fun fact. Delmi's is the strongest Pokemon ever invented, and it's so cool that we're about to lose. Thank God. Okay. We have to avoid all grass now. <laughs> now that we've caught the two strongest Pokemon in the game, we need to avoid all grass.
I don't even want to fight trainers. I'll just fight the Chansey Lady. I need a rando, man. My bag is full? What? There's a bag limit? Can berries be tossed? Alright, I guess we're using up potions then. By the way, we straight up cheat. Now we're actually just going to look up what the best natures for each of these guys are. Because I have no idea what the hell you're supposed to do with a Delmis or a Cryo. I don't know what you're supposed to do with an Arctazolt either. to tell me what the best nature for Drakezolt is, but not for Arctazolt. Ain't no one running Arctazolt in anything. Naive. Mount Torterra. Adamant. Aerodactyl. Jolly. Cryogonal. Is there anyone running competitive cryogonal out here? Dude, fucking no. No, there isn't. Timid. And then Delmies. I don't have any of these, by the way. Brave. Or Adamant. I actually might have Jolly. No, I have a long one. Fuck. I don't need any of this shit. Toss. Toss them all. Toss the X defenses. I was gonna try using them in battle, but it's far too late for that. That's cracked! anymore. You're gonna go, you're not feeling well. I'm sorry to hear that. I hope you get to feeling better. What were these? Oh, leaks? I don't even want them. I hope you get to feeling better. Yeah, I want the full rest off. You're a free heal to everyone, right? It doesn't matter. Is the rando guy here? He's not. We're stuck with Cryogonal. Uh. We gotta sell. Burn heal, ice heal, sweet apple, hyper potion, ether, dawnstone, shiny stone. Go ahead and sell like four of these. Sell my purple. Sell the purple nectar. Nectar. I'm never using it. Um. Yeah. Sell all of these because we don't need them. We may end up needing them in the future, but for now we're worried about uh having bag space. This is a very doomed run, but we're gonna. Make it out of here with what we can. 
I feel like I saw both. I feel like I saw both of these, please. selling blue orb yeah no these are some cracked ass items that's for true i would love to get a mega scissor i don't think it's gonna happen though okay bye yeah pitch me another ice beam i think cryogonal is gonna need it Thunderbolt as better than Thundershock. Shadow Ball's pretty cracked. We might just be in the, the brute force portion of this. All right, Amoongus is dead. Awesome. Yeah, we'll replace that so you can maybe do some damage next time. Uh, Delmi's already knows it. That's pretty based. Okay, you being able to set up double teams could go crazy. And I'm gonna let you do it. Um, get rid of curse. Get rid of synthesis. Paradox was in any of you crackheads need to learn surf now that all our guys are dead? Yeah, honestly, Delmi's welcome to the welcome to the crew. Enjoy having the move surf. Um, it's better than Whirlpool. I actually love the rest of your move set. That's really good. Actually, Delmi's, you're kind of cracked. We're gonna need these. I'm a 29 and a 7. Uh, yeah, and hit me with, uh, 5 Hyper Potions. It's like not a joke. I'm about to just... I didn't mean to leave. I was on super speed. I was gonna go look at the other items. Whatever, we're brute forcing the gym. <laughs> hey, you know, you know how it is. We're brute forcing it. Um... Yeah, man, we could have gotten a free heal. We could have healed all our guys for free. That's awesome. Uh, I definitely fucking misclicked there. No, you don't need to learn slam. Giga Drain, you don't need it. Sky Drop? I actually don't know what this is. Takes the phone to the sky, then drops it the next turn. I don't know what the benefit of that is, so we're not going to take it. I could be missing something cracked there. <sighs> Alright, you're a screen setter? That's a little crazy. Um, we don't need you to learn Slash, though. Confuse Ray? No, we're fine. Recover, however. Yeah, fuck it, whatever. Let's get wacky with him. I don't- okay, Solar Beam's a little too wacky for him. Night Slash? Why is he trying to learn every move? What is happening here? No, you don't need a slam. Heavy Slam sucks, unfortunately. 
Phantom Force uh, is not as good as Shadow Ball. It does slightly more damage, but Shadow Ball is a little base mode. Alright, here's the plan with Torterra. You have the Fire Berry, right? Yeah. Double Team, Leech Seed, Curse, Earthquake Spam. That's the fucking plan with Torterra. And we're gonna give him the Citrus Berry to give him a little more time to set up. And we're gonna give this Oka Berry that weakens fire moves to my ice type Cryogonal. And then we're gonna remind ourselves what type Delmes is. He's Ghost Grass. Congratu- Thank God the first gym we did was the Fire Gym. But we're gonna be prepared for any uh, incoming fire moves regardless. No flying? Ah! Alright. Okay, so Earthquake does nothing to your entire team. This is so lucky of me to have to go against this one first. Hit the Leech Seed. Get dodged. Alright. The plan is already in motion. The plan is already in play. We're going to try and stall out with Torterra. We've set up... Wait, is that set up one or two? I don't remember. That sets up one? I think we have to go deep. Then we set up our curses. Okay, Torterra's dead. Okay. What is this back sprite, Cryogonal? What is this? We're going for the sweep. Fuck, it's a fire type. We lose. What? I think I can earthquake you. Earthquake again. We lived. Aerodactyl saves the day. Emolga, get out of there. Aerodactyl saves the day. Aerodactyl's based. I won't- the Cryogonal definitely, like, helped save them there. With the screams. How dare you. Cryogonal sweep! Cryogonal sweep! Cryogonal's dead. I've given up on this run, as you can tell. A PC. I don't know what that does, but we're gonna go for it. Who's still alive on the team? We got Coolio, Aerodactyl, and Delmes. Truly legends of the Empire. I don't wanna fight you. Shit. Okay. Okay, this is fine. I think. Never mind, you're actually gonna beat the shit out of me. Okay, Aerodactyl's dead. I think I lose. I don't know why I just used Surf, to be honest with you. Is Discharge 80? No, Thunderbolt's better. See another run. <laughs> I 
I don't have anything to say. It was the moment everyone got one shotted. That was that was that run didn't go well. My planning was bad. The Pokemon I got were not much better. Really, it's Cartana's fault. Hey Pogo, I have some quest rewards for you. Wow, more rare candies. Oh, that's it. I wish I had a better starting Pokemon than fucking a Chikorita named Chomchi, to be honest with you. That's all there is to it. Um, That's that's Emerald Rogue with all the Pokemon active. Ultra Beasts kind of fucked me. It's still fun. It's still a fun game. Uh, that's going to be it for now, though. I'd use the restroom super bad, but not the same way last time. Just like, I had a piss. And I think I've hit, I've hit my, my tilt limit, as is tradition. Rogue Emerald, fun game. Check it out. It's Emerald Rogue, actually. Thanks for coming. I'll see you.